old Buffalo uh, band from Boston. Thank you. We usually play uh, louder and electric with the guitar, a bass, and a drums, but we decided to coffee house it. And we actually co we actually collaborated from afar with Nick without him really knowing about it. We said a poem to words, which you're going to sing uh, as well. Uh, we'll tell you about that when that comes up. In the meantime, this is a uh, not so old Buffalo Tom song from a couple of years ago.
that new record. Oh, thank you for that. Don't even know if we should call them CDs or don't even know if you call them files or anything. We're working on some music. And uh, Chris is going to sing one that we're working on now. I'm still learning the words too as well. some really big artists on like Bruce Springsteen and uh, they asked us if we would like to be part of that and we said yeah okay <laughs> sure 
Um, and they, they, uh, the idea was that it was going to, and it was a documentary <coughs> film, I believe, that came out as well. Um, and a guy named John McGaw out of like, West Boston was really the spearhead on it. And they really uh, encouraged collaboration with um, something related to homeless people. If you can maybe get a homeless person in that maybe plays guitar and that kind of thing. And um, we had just read um, Another Bullshit Night, and um, we knew Nick a little bit through Tom Johnston. And uh, we thought, well, uh, Tom, Tom, I think, had the idea of the poem, uh, which was set to a sort of a graphic uh, novel depiction kind of thing. Right. Um, yeah, it was called Father Outside. So we kind of took the words and molded them a little bit into a song that's called Ink Falling. Uh, it goes like this. Person come in and, and 
play guitars, <laughs> anything like that. We figured we would tie it into the homelessness by singing this poem that Nick wrote about his dad. I think that was self-evident, but maybe not. <laughs> How you doing out there tonight, people? <laughs> Wednesday night in January in the Scott Brown era. Feel pretty good, right? <laughs> more works in progress. I saw Nick read about, a, I guess, a month and a half ago, and it really was, it was great reading at Cambridge, and inspired me to, while we were working on this record, to go back and, you know, kind of choose words carefully, you know, it's great to see a poet, you know, read, and really slows you down, and makes you think about the different meanings of words. Influenced a lot of the stuff we were working on, besides doing and yeah. which was amazing too. Because here before we didn't pay any attention to the words. Yeah. <laughs> With that said, this is one of our, uh, this is a two minute pop song that we wrote. So, you know, like, so I hope you're settled in. It's yeah. a 20 minute this isn't actually, uh, tour d'horizon. Yeah. <laughs> if you gotta think about. popular demand. We don't, we don't want to cause them any problems here, so give the people what they want. This is an old Buffalo Tom song from 1992 or so, 91, 92.
Thank you.